Cuando, cuando, cuando We can share a love divine Please don't make me wait again we actually get tuxes before we're shipped away to prison. So that when we get out, we look nice. I hope you were the groom. See? But don't tell my wife I said that. Please. <laughs> Meglio stasera, a baby, go, go, go. Or as we natives say, fast be told. I finally know what it's like to finally be famous. What are they doing in there? A bunch of hens cackling is what it sounds like. <laughs> Sweaty. <laughs> All right, now come around. 
How you buying? Huh? Got her on camera. Did you? It's right here. No. <laughs> <laughs> This is the last time you'll get out of a car single. You lied to me. No, nope, that was the last time. And that, and that, and that. Proved you wrong. And that, and that, and that. Hey, you wanna help me out with this? So I don't rip it. That was great, sir. Fat guy in a little coat. What the hell's that supposed to mean? <laughs> <laughs> Mark, do you have the ring? Yes, I do. No, <laughs> you do not. Did I give it to you? I thought you... No, what? Please tell me I gave you the ring. No. I had it in this pocket in a bag. Did I give you the ring? You didn't give me the ring. I swear to God, you did not give me the ring. Why are you looking at me? I didn't even go inside. Don't kill yourself with the knife. We can... Let's go. Where are we going? Are we really doing this? The fellowship of the ring? <laughs> <laughs> that was so good. <laughs> you shall be the fellowship of the ring. Right. Where are we going? <laughs> Dude, I put it in these pants when we were at the house. You said you told me that. You said I got the key ring in the in my pocket. Could it have fallen out when you went at their house? It could have. Do you guys know how to get back to that house? Uh, no. Everybody climbing here. No, we're not doing that. No, we're not doing that. We're not doing that. I hate you, Mark. <laughs> <laughs> you, you dropped it. When? At the house. At your mom's house. You're a good best man, but you're also an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> now let me get my knife. So I can cut you. You dropped it out of your pocket? And I'm like, oh, what's this? Inside or outside? In the, in the, I mean the pla oh, in, outside on the sidewalk. <laughs> and I was like, oh, look, well, hey, what'd you drop here? You were way over there, but I looked at it and I thought, ooh. <laughs> See, I want to get this is this is his last walk. I'm gonna edit it. I'm gonna edit this, edit this in slow motion with some like depressing music. Including <laughs> the old people walking by with the yeah. fanny pack. Yep, it's gonna go weak, weak as I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. <laughs> I can look at my life and realize there's nothing left. <laughs> As I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I take a look at my life and realize there's nothing left. <laughs> Hey, don't I didn't look nice before. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I, I, I don't. You doing okay? Yeah, I'm doing good. good. How are you doing? Hey, buddy, it's a private ceremony. We're asking all homeless and vagrants just to. <laughs> I'll show you out. <laughs> oh, that was a good comeback. That was good. Burn! <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, it's hot. It's too much to ask for like Dave and Martha. You come. Flash freak She's blizzard. At the house taking pictures of Lee. Goodness gracious. It is breezy where we're going, so. 
That's what you keep telling me. I've yet to experience it. Oh, come on. Grandma, if you want to take a break, I said, here you can. Otherwise, it's... Well, we can take a break here. Well, how far is it? Um, it's probably about a quarter of a mile, yeah. <laughs> Do you want to take a break? No. <laughs> You're right on my back, Grandma. Um, Thank you. Hey, everyone, should we head with the name of the month? Take those glasses off. Should I? Yeah. yeah. And which side does it go on? Left, Left. I want to say. Um, put the pockets on that side. Should we ask David? Caitlin, left. you can answer. Um, for why don't we ask Darlene? <laughs> She's yep, walking yep. up. I'll let you put it in the pocket. No, it's there for right. I'm checking. Okay. Well, I'm making sure I got everything in. Let me come over this way. Sorry, guys. Here, move. That's amazing. Simply. I'm in the bushes. Yeah. Does that look good? Looks great. Straighten this tie. Hello. You know what we should have brought? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Hello there. Hi. Uh, wait, what? How y'all doing? Hello. Hey in paradise. Uh, just give me a second. There's the groom. You look handsome. I told my wife, I need to get a vest for this thing. Yeah. Bob Franklin. Alex. Nice Alex? Nice Mark Fontana. Mark Fontana. <laughs> Say something for the camera. Hey, Ro. Angus. <laughs> Fancy glasses. How about you? What? Kaylin, you're in the way. Anything yeah. profound? Yeah, you look great. Let me get that fuzz off your shoulder. Yeah. No, he my likes brother, it. Obviously, brother, he wants it my there. My brother doesn't know how to tie ties. I do know that it's tied. It's just loose. Thank you. You're welcome. Do you want me to fix it? Nothing. Horrible. You have no fashion. I'm waiting for profound. At Windsor. Profound words coming from. Let's yeah. yeah. find profound words. See, I wish I could tie Windsor's, but my tie, I'm just too long in the torso. Do you have anything profound to say? Yeah. Don't squat with your spurs on. Okay. Duly noted. Duly noted. Thank you. I found that one out the hard way. <clears throat> well. <laughs> that was the month I was singing soprano. Why do you have spurs? What are you, the assistant today or something? I don't like to talk about um, you look like an assistant. <laughs> you're carrying everything. I think that's the bag holder. You got, you're the bigger, the bigger, the bag lady. Yeah. Watch, be all serious, like you know. Oh wait. Even tweaking it up more. It just wants to twist. That's why he's picking up. Quit looking at your watch. <laughs> wait, turn back around a little bit and do the hands on the hips. <laughs> Is she even coming? Where is she? It was this weekend, right? Oh, that's right? a good one. <laughs> oh my gosh. And then this one. No, not that one. That yeah, doesn't that one fit. <laughs> that's after the wedding. All right. No, that's not. <laughs> no! It's a jubilant dance. Oh, Grandma. Still nothing? No, that's good. You can't milk the cow if the stool's too high. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> they have different, they're not all exactly the same. Well, someone called the cops. <laughs> Anything profound yet? Huh? Not yet. Sitting on the benches? Anything yeah. profound to say? I probably was following Kyle in here. I still think my don't squat with your spurs on is great. It's okay. strong, so solid. Are they gonna be You're weird. It's a life wisdom. lesson. Oh, I got one. Keep your stick on the ice. Yes, I've got one. I learned this one from Al, actually. Thank you. I can tell you you're a mechanic, Christian. <laughs> Never, ever, ever, never, never button the bottom one. Sometimes, always, never. And you only have two, so it's sometimes and never. 
So what's this profoundness you're gonna? Love that's it. My glasses oh. back until the wedding. highest meaning and the most ultimate purpose of marriage is to put the covenant relationship of Christ and His church on display. Think about that. At this time we're going to have the exchanging of the vows. If you want to turn and hold hands and look at each other. Byron, do you take Lee to be your lawful wedded wife to live together after God's ordinance in the holy estate of matrimony to have and to hold from this day forward for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health? Will you, Byron, love her and cherish her, honor and trust her, comfort and keep her and Byron, forsaking all others Keep you only unto Lee, so long as you both shall live. And Lee, do you take Byron to be your lawful wedded husband, to live together after God's ordinance in the holy estate of matrimony, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, Lee, will you love and respect him, honor and trust him, comfort and keep him, and leave, forsaking all others, will you keep yourself only unto Byron, so long as you both shall live. And now we're going to have the exchanging of the rings. So Byron, if you would take this ring, place it on Lee's finger, This ring I be with, with this ring I be with. And with all my earthly goods, with all my earthly goods, I be in doubt. I, be in doubt. I pledge my life and love to you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. And Lee, would you take this ring and take it by the finger? And repeat after me. Byron. With this ring, I be wed, and with all my earthly goods, I be in doubt. I pledge my life and love to you, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Since Byron and Lee have made these commitments before God in this assembly, by the authority of God as a minister of the gospel, and consistent with the laws of this state, I declare that Byron and Lee are husband and wife. <laughs> Byron and Lee, you are no longer two independent persons, but one. What therefore God has joined together, let not man put asunder. Byron, you may kiss your bride. Stay for pictures. This concludes the ceremony. But stay for pictures. Let's celebrate. Take this off and give it to you. And you right. get out. No. <laughs> you get out. There you have it, folks. <laughs> Throw it away.
Oh, hey, didn't notice you there. Glad you got to see me. <laughs>